friends. About four months ago, I had the audacity to react to my old selfies and they Are you sitting down? Yes, as you can see. Great! Our... Now I can tell you that I'm in a show! You are? Yes, I am. It's called Starter Pack. It's a comedy series by AT&T Hello Lab. And my character is a meme artist. An artist of memes, if you will. So go ahead and follow the Facebook page to see new episodes every Monday starting August 20th. Oh, that was a mouthful. Wait a minute. If you're in a show, that means I'm in a show too! Mm. I'm not sure about that. Yes, it's the plot twist of the century. Not only did I leave my house for the first time, but I left my house to have a little role in a show. Here's a little clip of my character, Kylie. <laughs> yep, my character's name is Kylie. <laughs> <clears throat> so, what type of memes do you do or create? I run at underscore fetches. <laughs> you know, things that are fetch, brunch, yoga pants, avocado toast, screenshotting conversations. <laughs> <laughs> so you make fun of basic stuff. <laughs> what? Hey, yo, Kylie. Yo, you still playing? Yep. Yes, so as you can see, Kylie's, she's really the whole package. I mean, self-absorbed, basic, uh, d Basic? What more could you ask for? And I just can't think of anything more basic or self-absorbed than recreating my old selfies. So let's get to it. I think this is my first time ever filming in my car. Hey guys, welcome back to my car vlog. Everyone meet Dreamy. My car's name is Dreamy. No regrets there. And for the first photo on my to recreate list, we have this little number right here. When Bay says you look like a snack. <laughs> and I have my hair parted in a way that would make my middle school self proud. <sighs> because I used to part my hair on the entire other side of my head. And this would be me. I, I'm giving Deb from the Wild Thornberries a run for her money. Anyways, I'm now going to go to the grocery store to pick up my little hair accessory. Other people may refer to it as a watermelon, but not on this channel. It's a helmet. So actually, I think that I'm not too comfortable filming while driving. So I'll see you when I get there. Approximately 32 seconds later. Uh, yeah. I sure hope it does. Haha, <laughs> nailed it. This is my second time leaving my house ever. So far not a fan, there are people outside. I can't believe they had the goal to leave the house the same day I left the house. We should have really coordinated beforehand so that only one of us would be out and about. Oh god, someone just pulled next to me. I guess that's my cue to go into the grocery store. Let's do this. Okay, I got the watermelon. I repeat, I got the watermelon. I must have looked like I was on something because I just stared at watermelons for an uncomfortable amount of time. But here's the thing. I really don't think this is gonna fit my head. Oh, maybe it will. He has like a... F Let's go home and crack one open with the boys. Be safe, honey. <laughs> Alrighty, now let's play a fun game of is this watermelon as big as my head? What do we think? It looks like it's gonna fit and if it doesn't it just means my brain is too big <laughs> Okay, so my strategy here was cutting it like a pizza My next strategy in getting the watermelon into this bowl is by asking it nicely Hey, buddy. Hop into that bowl for me. That's it, I'm just gonna use my hands. This is like pumpkin carving. About 13 minutes later. Whew, don't tell anyone, but I am kind of winded from gutting a watermelon. These are the final results. 
Alrighty, it's the moment of truth. Is my head as big as this watermelon? Asking the important questions. It fits! I feel like Cinderella and this is my glass slipper. I look like a mushroom. <laughs> okay, it's finally time to take the picture. Oh my god. I realized I needed to cut a window into my helmet like the picture. Oh. So in this picture, my bangs are strapped down on my forehead. My shirt was much more fitted in this picture. I'm just gonna clip it. This hand like this. This is such an unnatural pose. All right, hopefully that does it. I'm sweating. Drum roll, please. to be honest, not my best work. If I were picky, which I am, I am so picky. The position of my head throws this entire photo off. <laughs> Don't even get me started how these two photos look like two completely different people. <laughs> these look like Kylie Jenner's before and after photos. <laughs> However, I will say I nailed the body language. And so for that, I will rate this recreation a 6.9 out of 10. All right, so now that I've had my little watermelon snack. I'm feeling healthy, feeling fit, and I think I should now give myself a little treat by recreating my sugar lips photo. Watermelons on the head, sprinkles on the lips. Middle school was an interesting time, which brings me to my tutorial, how to achieve sugar lips like a pro. Swipe up. First, apply a sticky base. I'm just gonna use lip gloss. And the final step is getting more action than I've had in months and kissing the sprinkles. Now it's time to lay outside on some grass to recreate the picture and completely weird out my neighbors. I'm expecting a package today and it's already middle of the afternoon so they should be arriving any second. So let's get to it. All right, well, neighbors, you're welcome for the show. I am going to get the heck out of here before the delivery man comes. <laughs> and the result is... Welcome to the frickin' candy shop. That is what I'm talking about. I rate this little recreation a nine out of 10. I had a DACA point because that is a drastic difference in brows. <laughs> Thank God. Alrighty, enough fun and games. It's time for the grand finale and we are going to crank things up several notches. There is nothing quite, you know, quite than this photo right here. It's Mr. Steal Your Girl back at it again. Just check out these threads. These are my stepdad's clothes that my mom picked out for me. <laughs> Not even sure what this is. I'm gonna go with handkerchief. I don't know, we're gonna figure it out. Where are the buttons? Do boy clothes not have buttons? I don't understand, do they just use their mind games and manipulation tricks to make sure their clothes stay together? Whoa, <laughs> the tea is hot, ladies and gents. Teddy, where are you going? Business on the top, party on the bottom. <laughs> that is not correct. Does my mustache look like my middle school eyebrows? OOTD! Alright, um, thanks for coming to my TED talk. Don't smoke, kids. I don't, which is why I'm using a pencil, so don't get it twisted. Now that that's out of the way, let's make the magic happen. What is a girl to do with all this big dick energy? Enough of the small talk. It's time for the grand reveal. I look at these photos next to each other and the only word that comes to mind is daddies. This is the art that feeds my soul.
12 out of 10. 12 out of 10. I mean, I should just prevent my mom from seeing this video until Christmas. Frame those two photos side by side and bam, you're suddenly the best kid in the world. You know what they say, a recreation of a photo a day keeps the doctor away. Thank you so much for watching my lovelies. And here is all the love just for you. And don't forget to check out my girl Kylie in Starter Pack. <laughs> I meant my character, Kylie. Force of habit. <clears throat> Link in bio. <laughs>